9 a.m. I'm Michelle Griego. And I'm Brian Flores. Good morning, everybody. We do start CBS Colorado mornings at 9 with some breaking news. A suspect is dead and a Denver police officer is in the hospital after a shooting. And this happened at 26th and Zunai around 4.30 this morning near a hotel. Justin Adams is on the scene right now. And Justin, what's the latest? Well, investigators are continuing to look over the scene. Actually, I want you to take a look at it right now. You can see several different investigators looking at the patrol car where the officer was attacked at earlier this morning in the shooting. Now, you can take a look at several at, at the patrol car and you can see several bullet holes and broken glass under it. Denver police tells me the suspect walked inside the Quality Inn Hotel past the patrol vehicle, then moments later came out and started firing at the officer. The officer was hit three times, twice in the back and once in the chest. The officer was wearing his bulletproof vest. Both were taken to the hospital where the suspect died and the officer survived. Denver Police Chief Ron Thomas talked to the officer in the hospital and knew this incident could have been worse. That we are certainly thankful that uh, we still have one of our officers. Um, but you know, I think we recognize that we face these these, uh, these challenges every day, and I'm proud of the men and women that have put on this badge and uniform, uh, knowing that they that they confront these things every day. You could tell that Officer Ron Thomas very emotional there. You can also see the investigator still looking over that vehicle. Now, the officer is expected to survive and is in the hospital surrounded by his family. The officer is also a veteran, and Chief Ron Thomas said that this officer has been on the department for at least 10 years, but very fortunate to be able to survive this morning. In Denver, Justin Adams covering Colorado First. All right, Justin, we appreciate the update. Thank you. We now know the winner of the mayoral election here.